addition and subtraction of directed numbers. That is, the addition and subtraction of positive numbers and negative numbers. When adding directed numbers, we usually simplify by removing the brackets. By omitting the plus sign when it means add, we also omit the plus sign on the first number when it is positive. Thus, positive 3 added to positive 7 is written as 3 plus 7. Here we omit the plus sign that means add and we omit the plus sign because the first number is positive. Similarly, negative 3 added to negative 7 is written negative 3 added to negative 7. So we omit plus sign. Similarly, negative 3 added to positive 7 is written this way. Negative 3 added to positive 7 with the plus sign being omitted when it means addition. And positive 3 added to negative 7 is written this way. The rule for subtraction. Subtraction of a directed number is the same as addition of that number with its sign change. So positive 3 subtract positive 7 is equal to positive 3 added to we change the sign in the 7 negative 7. Similarly, negative 3 subtract negative 7 is the same as negative 3 added to, we change the sign in the 7, positive 7. Negative 3 subtract positive 7 is the same as negative 3 added to negative 7. And positive 3 subtract negative 7 is the same as positive 3 added to, change the sign, positive 7. So now to the actual addition. If we have two positive numbers or two negative numbers, we add the numbers and keep the sign. So here we have positive 3 added to positive 7. The two signs are the same. So we add 3 to 7 to get 10 and we keep the sign. Both signs are positive, so we get positive 10. Similarly, we have negative 3 being added to negative 7. Both signs are the same, so we add the numbers 3 plus 7 is equal to 10 and we keep the sign negative 10. Conversely, if one number is negative and one positive, we subtract the smaller from the bigger number and we take the sign of the larger number. So we have here positive 3 added to negative 7. We have a positive sign and we have a negative sign, so the both signs are different. We're going to subtract the smaller from the bigger. 7 subtract 3 is equal to 4. And the bigger number, the 7, has a negative sign. So the answer of a negative sign. So it's negative 4. Second example, we have negative 3 being added to positive 7. We have negative and positive. The both signs are different. So we subtract. 7 subtract 3 is equal to 4. We keep the sign of the larger number. In this case, the larger number is positive. So the answer is positive for. And that's it for this video. I am Mr. Dubey. If you found this video helpful, if you appreciate what I am trying to do on this channel, please like this video. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe. See you in the next video.